<laughs> so you're out here braving the cold today. What? Why are you out here? It'd be a lot more comfortable at home, wouldn't it? Just to be able to get our bikes, to be able to ride, and just to be able to hang out and have fun with all the skaters, because they all accept us here, so it's easier to be out here now. So in the summer, it's, we're able to ride out and just have fun at the skate parks and not get kicked out and have our bikes stuck in away. Like, I got a $130 ticket for riding at the skate park, so it's just time to take charge and get our bikes back and take care of everything. All right, well, great. I think we're going to do it. I really do. Look at all these people. So these are about perfect conditions for Flatland oh, BMX, right? Oh, it's great. Setting new precedents, you know? <laughs> like, I'm all about getting in the middle of the street when it's snowing outside. Flatland, I, Snowland. Snowland? Snowland, there you go. But this uh, event does mark an occasion. That's the first time my bike's ever seen snow or rain or anything <laughs> oh, like that. I hope it's going to be okay, right? It's going to be okay. We're going to find out. Oh, boy. Uh, uh, you'll be cursing me later, perhaps. Well, well, thank you now for being out here. Oh, this is an awesome event, guys. We gotta push this. We gotta come back on another day and do this again and again and again yes. and again. Uh, That's why I kind of thought it's like, well, we could cancel, and I'm like, no, let's just do it. And if we need to do it again, we'll do it again. We'll do it again. Yeah. I mean, that's what it's gonna take. BMX is not a crime. <laughs> you don't think it should be a crime to ride a bike in a park? Not at all, because everyone else rides bikes and they do just fine. And you so. don't think it's a, a danger in having the, the mixed, uh, you know, having skaters and BMX at the same time? No, if everyone like takes a turn and be careful of what they're doing and where they're going, it shouldn't be a problem. Good one. Yeah. Yeah. All right, Joe. Yeah. So we've had rain, sleet, snow, and we got people out here. We're out of here, man. Look at that. We got Bike Swarm. We got BMX Group. We got Occupy Gresham. I mean, we got a crowd, man. Worst day of the year. The protests, and we got like 35 people. Fantastic. Um, I I had some salad. Oh, you did? Oh, that was for you. I don't get that. I right. just don't get it. Right. <clears throat> My kids ride. They have to ride all the way out to Sydney to ride their bikes, or they have to go all the way to 82nd to climb people. I want to stay here. Where when we were initially exploring this, the risk manager said, you know. You can do that, but you're, you're going to be raising the potential for liability for the city. And we don't recommend it. That was kind of their position. Um, but, yeah, clearly other communities are doing it, and they're fine. And I, I, I haven't researched them to kind of get 
what's different. From a safety <coughs> argument too, you know, having kids hanging out at a skate park is better than having them in the back alleys in the neighborhood and running around in weird places and, and doing that kind of thing. So from a community standpoint, having kids from a parent standpoint where you know they're going to be, there's witnesses there, there's other kids, and, you know, there's going to be less bullying because there's more people around that can prevent that kind of thing. It's a public right. From a safety standpoint, in that regard, it, there's less personal safety instead of the crash risk. Right. 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 Like one!